What's up, beautiful people? It's Regina Michelle. I'm going in here to Irondale Pickers, and hopefully they won't act crazy with me today and be polite about me paying all my boo. I just got out of church. I played for two church services and feeling real good today. The sun is shining, so let's see how it go. We're going to go ahead and go into Irondale Pickers. So I always like to go to the antique booth on Sundays. That's the best day for me, and most of the time I always have to move items out of the booth because a lot of people like to walk around with items in their hands and they will just place items in your booth. So I'm just taking the items back to the front and just making sure everything is in place. I got to get some sales moving. When I'm looking at this and I I may put some of these items on eBay, like these plates. They don't have a real high selling rate, but I got to get these items moving. And I can't believe no one has purchased these items because they're so nice. Good morning, good morning. I have this cabbie shirt it sold for $18 and the buyer is paying shipping on it and today is Monday so I will be sending this out today hope y'all having a great day somebody sent the offer on this cork silkle for $10 so I'm not accepting $10 for this. Maybe 13, but not 10. People try to make some money out here, not pennies. Your time and effort is worth it. And I'm not, I, I don't have time to be wasting time. So I'm not accepting that offer. So I am down here in the dungeon. That's what I call this unfinished room down in the basement, the dungeon because I don't like coming down here and I need to straighten up. I got a lot of stuff to do down here, so I'm gonna be organizing some of this stuff down here. I don't know why I can't stay organized, y'all. It's hard, but let me show y'all what's on this table that I'm fixing to organize. So I have all this stuff on the table that I need to throw away. I'm keeping this, these bowls and stuff. And I gotta get all this stuff organized. I am I plan to sell this. I plan to sell this. This has been listed. I need to organize it. And the rest of this stuff is going in the trash, except this purse. So I need to get this table organized and get some things listed. So that's what I'll be doing tonight. So I will be, it's a lot of dust flying. I'll be doing some of this tonight. You know, you just do a little bit at a time. That's all we can do sometimes is just take your time and just do a little bit until you meet your goal. So. I don't know why I can't stay organized. It's just not one of my strong suits, so. But I try to do the best I can. But I'm gonna show you some of the things I'm gonna be putting in my antique booth. Now these two pictures, they came from my house that we're no longer using anymore. And these are heavy too. Those are nice. Don't know who they're by, but it's heavy. Feels like it's about 20 pounds. And somebody should want them. It's two of these here. I'm not gonna pick the other one up because don't feel like doing any exercise right now. So I'm gonna have to get me some oversized trash bags to move a whole lot of stuff in here. It's just kind of hard working down here when it's so disorganized. So I really need to get it together. So that's what I'll be working on this weekend. I'm, I was gonna do it tonight, but my mind just won't let me concentrate right now. So 
we're gonna move on upstairs. So I made it back upstairs and I feel better now since I'm up here. It's dark down there. It's kind of the environment, the, just the environment down there and the feel is different. I've been trying to work on the downstairs for a long time, just trying to get it to my liking and getting the feel right. It's hard to work in an environment where you're uncomfortable in. So I got to definitely get it together. But today I went to my daughter's um, award day and it's called um, a recognition day. It's for all the graduates going to the next grade and everybody get their awards based upon their performance, how they did in school and everybody get their little certificate to go to the next grade. And my daughter, she's going to the fifth grade and I am excited about it. And I'm so, I feel so relieved now since school is about to be out and I just start feeling good because I don't know if y'all watch Hump Day Hangout. I'm always talking about how school had me stressed out because I have to help her with all her homework. And it's, it's, I don't, I don't remember my parents having to, I just don't remember the homework being so overwhelming the way it is. And it's just a bit much y'all for me to have to go back through the fourth grade and doing all these fourth grade assignments. So now I guess I'm going to the fifth grade now and I'll be helping her with that too. But I am very relieved that school is out. The traffic is going to be lighter. Won't have to worry about the school buses and all that school traffic. Everything just starts feeling lighter in the summer. And you just, for me, I feel so much better. Oh, and my daughter, she did perform um, today. So during the awards program, they had the choir to sing and the recorder. It's, the, it's a recorder that the children play. It looked like a little flute. They played their songs and it was really nice. And my daughter, she played her recorder along with the other children. And I was proud of her, but so we did that earlier and then we had an evening program so about six o'clock so i've been at her school all day today and to be honest i feel overstimulated i'm the type of person like i get overstimulated being around a lot of different people and just feeling a whole lot of energy and and just it just i don't know i'm just i don't know if y'all get like that when you're just having to be around a lot of people and got to, hey, how you doing? And it's just, it's just a bit much today. So I'm glad all of it is over with. Y'all, I really need me a self-care day where I just do something I want to do and just have some fun and take care of me, like get my hair done. I am thinking about getting my hair done and cutting at least about two inches off. This is how I've been wearing my hair. And right now it looks a hot mess to me. <laughs> but I haven't feel I haven't felt like doing anything to it. So it's time for a self-care day so I can feel alive again. If you all sell on eBay, did y'all use your $25 coupon? I did, so I'm gonna see what's. I tried getting something different. It's like a variety of stuff. Show y'all what I got in the box. It's a, it's an unboxing of eBay stuff. Of course, you gotta have your eBay tape, and I got two of these. I think this was thirty four dollars. This, this package here. So I got two eBay tapes. And I got these bubble mailers. What size is this? It does not say on here what the size is. But it looks like it's um 
where you can put a small book in. Y'all can see how big it is. Cause I can't remember the sizes of this. And then this is the next size padded envelope. This will be good for a whole lot of stuff to put in. So you can get an idea of how big they are because I wish they would have wrote it on the back of it, but the size is not on here. And then I have some poly mellers. Take this. This will be better to get this open with. I got this from eBay too. I didn't get this from eBay. I got this from Amazon. So I got some poly mellers. These you can fit shirts and things in here. Looks like about 50 bags are in here. If you all, I probably put it on the screen of the the package I got. Then I got some eBay stickers. I try to get different things sometimes. And I don't know what's in here. Uh oh, it's hard to open. I hope y'all got some fun things to do for the weekend or did some fun things for the weekend. I plan to go visit some family go visit my mother-in-law. Now people say I live in a rural area. She really lives in, out in the country. These are some thank you cards. It says, of course it says thanks. And it says, your order made my day. I hope this package makes yours. That's cute. I like that. Yeah. It's a good bit in this. It's about 25. Just something different to get sometime. And, okay, got something else in here. There's some little boxes. They are the six by four. You can put mugs in here. I don't find a whole lot of mugs though. Like people be finding those Starbucks mugs and Disney mugs. Let's see. I would like to find those mugs and things, but I never find them. And these are the last I don't know what you can put in here, but it's flat like a almost like a it's almost like a flat rate envelope. I don't know what you would put in this. I can't think of anything I would put in this. But it, I guess you can, what would y'all put in this? It stretches out. I can't, I don't think I have anything that I would use these for just yet, but no telling. I'm sure I will come across something that I may have to use these. And it's just one, two, it's four of these. So that's all I have. I have some affiliate links listed in the description. Like if you wanna buy this, this Rolo that I use. The affiliate links are just things that I use for like my poly mailers and everything that I use for eBay, like my tape. 
all of my supplies, even like this Rolo, it's a affiliate link if you want to check them out. Even if you don't buy nothing, just click on the link. <laughs> but, you know, the affiliate link is just to, um, it will just, you know, give me a small, come. I get a small percentage, not a whole lot, but. They're there in the description if you see it. If you ever see anything on my video, which I'm using, then they will be in the description for you to check out. But I hope y'all have a great day. And as always, be blessed and shine bright.